today we are going to start third chapter of EVS, My Family. We all live in a house with our family. Mother and father are called our parents. Our brothers and sisters are called our siblings. There are different kind of families. This is picture of a small family. A small family has parents and one or more children living together. This is picture of a big family. You can see in this picture grandparents, parents and children. So this is big family. Now look at this picture. There are many members. This is a picture of a joint family. A joint family comprises grandparents, parents, uncle, aunt and children. These are grandparents, parents, uncle, aunt and children. And these children are called cousins. Those are children of our uncle and aunt are called cousins. Now, we will talk about relation of family members or relation of relatives. Father's father is called grandfather or dadaji. Father's mother is called grandmother, dadi. Mother's father is called grandfather, nana. Your mother's mother is called grandmother, nani. Father's brother is called uncle, means kaka or chacha. Father's sister is called aunt, you can say bua or poofy. Mother's brother is called uncle mama and mother's sister is called aunt mossy. Uncle or aunt children are our cousins. So children, a happy family is that where all members take care of each other, share things and live peacefully. A family which lives in harmony and respects each other is an ideal family. All the members of family share their same surname. You can see if there is a boy whose name is Devrana. Dev is his name and Rana is surname. For example, Rana, Thakur, Varma, Valya, Jain and Dhingra. These are our surnames. Surnames are when we write our name, first name and next is our surname. Like Sharma, Singla, uh, Valya and more. So children, today we have learnt about the chapter my family of EVS. So you learn many kind of families about today like small family, big family and joint family and relation of other relatives. So you will do practice of given worksheets and try to read these lines of the chapter so you can understand the relation of the relatives. Thank you.